Hi, this is Eve Heaton with Science Notebooking at blogspot.com and I'm here today to show you how you can make a cute back to school presentation for students about your summer vacation. So um, what I have here is a general sort of outline that I put together. I'm going to put it in presentation mode to show you how it's going to work and then we're going to go through this last one together. So what we're going to do is put it in presentation mode. So obviously if I was talking to children about my awesome summer vacation, I would talk about um, the various places that I've been, sort of what I've been up to, and again I've sort of hyperlinked all of these items so it works together. So we're going to do this last one right here together as a group. So hold on one second. Alright, so what we're going to do right here is set up this last one. So what you do is you insert and I use the shape box right here. I like the shape with the rounded um, edges here, so I'm going to go ahead and do that. Now normally what I do is I set up the first one and then copy um, copy and paste it, but just for this presentation we're actually going to put it in. And um, if you right click inside the box and you to pick edit text, you can put in your uh, category, so mine was canning. But I want it to look like all the others, this is sort of the default shape, so I'm going to actually highlight the text turn it to black, I'm going to right click on the box, go to format shape at the bottom, and I'm going to say I want no fill, and there we go, it sort of looks like everything else, and you can sort of move it around now. I do want the line coming out of it, so that's pretty easy, you're just going to go to insert shapes, pick your line, and then just draw your line straight to it, well that wasn't very straight, but right there, straight-ish to it, okay, I'll go back and fix that, but you get the general idea. So I um, took this picture off the internet. I just did a copy and paste situation right here. And that's what I did for all of these. It makes it a little more attractive for students. And I let them pick which one they want to view first. It's kind of fun for the kids. Um, now, I had already pre-set up the pages because I knew I was going to need a total of five pages. First page being the title one. Then the second page obviously would be the, the first thing I had up here. So page two, page three, page four, page five. So this would be one two, three, four. So it'd be actually pages two, three, four, and five. Okay. So once I have this um, set, so I, I pretty much set up the whole thing first, how I want it to look. I put all my pictures in just like this. And I'm actually going to take this out so I can show you what I did here. So let me go ahead and take these out. Okay. Um, so right now what I'm going to do is link this. So I'm going to click on it and if you go to where it says, um, it's not animations, I'm sorry, insert, right here it says hyperlink, it's got an action. So I'm going to say action, I want it to hyperlink to that last page. So I'm going to go to slide and it's going to list all your slides and it's going to give you a nice little thumbnail over here, so slide five, okay. And I'm going to hit OK again. So now when I go to it, design mode, it will take me to slide five. But I'm not finished. I need to put in the home button so it'll take me home. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a shape. I'm going to do a little circle right here. Again, I don't want it blue. I want it red. So format shape. I want a solid, oops, solid fill. But I want to change my color to red. And I want the line around it also to be red. So there you go. Close. I'm going to put a little text box in there that says home. So, all right. So I've got that. Kind of put them right next to each other. And what I'm going to do is, I'm just going to move that a little bit closer to the word home. Click on the, oops, bear with me here. Click on the red button right there. And you're going to go back to insert action, hyperlink that, and it's going to be back to the first slide, which you could go first slide right here, which would be no problem, or you could go to slide, pick the first one, hit OK, hit OK again. Okay, So we've now officially set it up, and obviously this would be inserting pictures, so it's very quick and easy, and then I would talk to the kids about vacation. Okay. So let's go put it in design mode and see the whole thing work. So on the last one, you just click on it. It'll take you to it. You click on your red button to go home, and you're back at home. So that is how you set up a very quick sort of back-to-school presentation for students. It's also very easy for students to do on their own. What I've done with them before is that they would just get clip art representing what they did. So if they pick beach up here, they would put beach clip art here. 
and then I'd let them present to the class or present to another student um, so they can share what they did over the summer break.